going on guys? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 3. I know this is un unplanned, unscheduled, but, you know, what can we do? Uh, we've been rolling around the new Nissan GTR R33 that we won a while ago. Uh, we've been doing a hell of a career on the mode on this to try to get ourselves some money out, but it's just really not working. Every time I get a new, new car, I decide to get bored and go and customise it. Hope you guys enjoyed the LSPDFR series. I thought I'd go and make this video afterwards because I didn't get to get really talk to you guys much about what's been going on. Um, like I said, it did have to. It did take a long time for me to get LSPDFR running. I, I had a massive headache. So really late when I'm recording. It's like one o'clock in the morning. So we're gonna, you know, just jump out and race, and also tell you what's been going on lately. So we are actually using that. Oh come on. We are actually using the hate shifter, which for some reason, even though I went driving today, I felt like I wanted to put this one out after LSPDFR. Um, you know, because you know my license and everything is you know, getting ready for. Yeah, the car that I actually drove today was actually a six-speed manual. I've never driven a six-speed manual before. I've only driven a five. Whoa! Fucking hell, I just don't care. Outback Kobe ready scramble. Alright, let's see. Alright. So that's a championship. I'm gonna click on the championship. Four drives, huh? Alright, let's see what let's see what form is we've got. This one is gonna oh, be fun. Hello. Heavy hitters. So Nothing I mean ha happy Saturday morning everyone. <laughs> Your weekend's gonna go well. I mean, I've got, um, got my weekend planned out. Uh, what do I want? Might actually, you know what, let's, let's do something really interesting and actually take our Halo, our Halo vehicle out. We'll switch the gearbox over to manual uh, paddle shift. So, I mean, we didn't want to record a stream tonight because, you know, I've had lack of sleep lately. I had to get ready for a driving test yesterday. So, I thought, you know what, why not after LSPDFR? I know there's still a few codes that I'm learning, you know, still a few roles that are coming. But, you know, what can you do, guys, honestly? Oh, look at that beast. That's the Rocks car. <laughs> We're the only one driving a Warthog. Kind of funny, really. So we'll go switch out the difficulties a bit. Notice I've been winning too much, so... Take that off manual. Pipes will... Bring it off to highly skilled. Um, just to, you know, bring off the simulation damage to 85%. Download any new driver tires. And let's go racing. Gonna be fun. Already being shoved between cars here. Might race with a controller next time and you know see how easier it is to compare to it. Oh! Yeah, sometimes my wheel tends to um, argue the point with me. Because I got it's forced feedback tends to argue. So I might have to bring that down. I'm trying to find a video for the right setting for it. So if you guys actually can leave, want to leave a comment down below and how, how hard the uh, force, force feedback uh, can actually come. Uh, I'm probably mumbling half the time guys because I'm over tired at the moment. Probably shouldn't have used the fucking warthog. I forgot to say traction control back on didn't I? Why is one of them rolling around in this scramble? Got uh, three laps. See if we can get a decent position. We're, what? We're right in the last place? That doesn't seem right. He's gonna have better luck than this. But remember the last time we had him above average? They, um. They still didn't give in too well, so I'm thinking we might have to go back to that since highly skills are a little bit overrated for me! Jesus Christ! Can't even get my car in the right direction. <clears throat> yeah, now we're gonna be definitely finishing the last here. Warthog wasn't probably the most smartest thing to pick. I reckon we'll finish this race, go to the next one and just 
Yeah, Warthog, not the brightest thing to pick. So, might switch it up in another car. Warthog's clearly not that fast. And it's designed to, you know, go off-road and have a little bit of fun everywhere else, but not really designed for racing, so... You know what, what, what can we do? So yeah, like I said guys, happy Saturday everyone, hope you Saturdays, hope you guys got the weekend planned out. I'm trying to get some time with my kids as my ex-partner is just being a little bit of a nutcase at the moment, I don't know what's wrong with her. Ever since she's uh, been pregnant with, with our son for the last couple of couple of months, she's been real moody and hormonal and real protective of, of, my, t of my two oldest kids. Um, so, you know, I'm trying, I'm trying to just, you know, stay calm. Yeah, no, 11th place. Yeah, we could have done better, but, you know, we picked a stupid car, so. You know what? Fuck, we're just going to continue on. So, I mean, we can't really, can't really blame ourselves. We might go find a different full drive to racing. We could earn a little bit more cash. We're getting up there, we're getting where we need to be, so, you know, we're getting noticed, so that's all that matters. Oh, we have festival expansion ready. Now, we might actually cruise to that. I reckon we might actually cruise down to the uh, festival expansion and hey, Dingo. expand a few things. Festival site expansion plan 1614-B ready to be put into effect. Right, so we're say? level three I'm here. An what, are we, what are we, level three here? Um, yeah, let's go ahead and upgrade, upgrade the Gold Coast. Turn around. One more to do so. Might go and switch a car over on the other festival and might take a cruise down to the festival this time, you know, so I can actually, you know, you guys can get to know a little bit more what's been going on. Yeah! I'm sorry, I'm having too much fun here. Um, and yeah, I mean, we've, got, we've been having a great, great time in the LSLA, we've been streaming, recording. Um, we've actually got some other streamers and recorders cutting with us. We've actually got another group coming up for a vice president, a vice president of a boxing league club. Um, I don't know what Raj is doing with that. Where am I? Oh my god, where's the entrance? Where's the entrance? There's the entrance. I can't remember where the entrance to this fucking festival is. So we've also, we've also got our Subnautica coming too, guys. I'm actually actually terrified of recording that because, oh boy, I've seen, and I mean, I have seen the gameplay. I've actually played on it once. I did it in a sandbox mode or creative mode, I think it was. And when I saw one of those Reaper Leviathans, it scared the absolute hell out of me. I haven't seen a Ghost Leviathan yet. I'm worried, I'm scared of going that far out to the void because... Um, me, I get, I get scared pretty easy though. Even though, you know, it's only a game and everything, but it just, you know, it's it's a hell of a scary game, guys. Honestly, you know, I ain't gonna lie. You know, I get scared every now and then. Uh, what car are we gonna cruise in? I don't know. I'll find a decent car. Mm. Okay, okay. Big one, big one, big one, so many. Um, you know what, we'll go our Skyline. Screw it. So we'll go our Skyline, we'll switch out, back out to the uh, H shifter and we'll just go for a cruise along the highway out to the festival. Not going to do too much racing, just going to get a little, little, a few skill points behind us. You know, get a few things done. Uh, difficulty, and then a manual or clutch. Uh, won't turn the stability control off because I, me and my mates were actually playing this the other day. And it was actually hilarious with, what, with the way it was. Um, my mate actually played this game for the first time after driving a real Ford um, in his real life because he actually owns an XR6 Turbo. I was driving the uh, GT. He was driving the GT on this. Turns around, tells me to turn civility control, ABS off, and traction control. He was just clutching like no tomorrow. And he was, oh mate, it was just, it was priceless. I couldn't stop laughing. Me and my mates, we couldn't stop laughing. 
Um, another mate ended up jumping on the Hot Wheels track, which was kind of hilarious. So that was funny to watch. Hey, watch it out, Mr. Burnley. Come on. Out of our way. Over rev. <coughs> so, I mean, we were just having a great time on, 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 this, on the game the other day. We couldn't help ourselves but to pick the crap out of each other because, you know, of our driving skills. Uh, we were actually coming along the highway, being a pack of morons. Um, each having a go on the highway, seeing who could get the fastest. Um, so, it was a hell of a, you know, hell of a day for a hell of a afternoon. Turn simulation damage off, I reckon. Just so uh, the car actually looks nice when we're actually going down. Uh, but yeah, I mean, we've been having great fun on LSLA. You know, all the new stuff that's coming out. I'm waiting for him to get rid of the controller configuration so that way I can actually use my controller because the keyboard actually hurts my hand. And you guys actually hear a lot of the clicking in the keyboard. Um, I'm looking for a new uh, editing software too, guys. If you want to, you know, strike that out my way. Uh, just point it out. You know, let me know what uh, editing software I should use. Uh, look, I'm willing to pay for the editing software as well. Uh, LSPDFR finally came back out. Of like I said, in the LSPDFR took it took me all day. It was a pain in the neck, constantly trying to find what plugins were wrecking it. Uh, updating all the new to the new plugins. Jesus Christ! Whew. Let's see if that was real life. I would have shit myself. That was that was scary. Oh Jesus! But I mean. And then I, when I found the map converter for uh, XML maps to turn into YMP maps, YMP, <laughs> YMAP, uh, yeah, YMAP maps, I, I had to give it a go, see what maps I could get in. It took me a while to get everything running. I think there was a map the reason the game crashed, so I mean, I'm going to try to fit, work on that, get it fixed. Uh, get that working and running, see if I can uh, try to fix it up. <laughs> Um, get distracted. <laughs> um, take whatever map is causing that problem. Uh, see if I can fix it. Um, so, yeah. Oh, somebody's fence. Jesus. Yep, call the cops on me for that one. Um, so, I mean, I'm just happy LSP if I was working again. American Truck Simulator is still being worked on because it's of the new updates that are coming out. So a lot of a lot of the uh, mods are updating because a lot of the modders don't like to keep their mods up to date. So it's kind of annoying when, you know, you go through. I mean, we want, I wanted to cruise around as Busted's uh, Kenworth W900, but unfortunately the mo uh, engine mods broke. None of the engine mods uh, sounds wanted to work. So I couldn't get any of that running. I know ETS now have their uh, 1.3, 1.3, uh, uh, which one is it? 1.32 update. Um, so it's, you know, and I know ATS is coming, coming along fine. Hopefully we get to see ATS is uh, B double, you know, where you get to own your own trailers and everything. So let's go ahead and update the, upgrade this enough to with a chip, uh, chip chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, let's see what expansions we get out of this. I'm thinking brand new stages, brand new rides, double the square footage in the auto show. Get out of here, boss. Go on. Let me work. Yeah, you never work anyway. No, you do. <laughs> That's what I like about it. Works harder than I do. All I do is sit in here and play. All right, let's see what we can buy. Uh, nothing really taking my fancy, honestly. Mm -hmm. 
I don't care. So, sat back out for a little bit of more cruise so you know, have a little more time to talk to you. Now get out there and see what this place has to offer. Oh, got some new races. So I've definitely got to catch up on all this and try to get everything, you know, working again, I guess. Try to get back into place. Um, where do we want to go? Yeah, it's the only way we can get out of this damn map, so... But, um, I mean, when, when ATS and ETS get their stuff together, because I noticed they're paying more attention to ETS than they are ATS. Really, dude? Really? No worries. You have arrived at your destination. So, we might actually do one more race, you know, since we're kind of running out of things to do. So, let's go. Yeah, let's go, the big boys. Let's bring out my heavy beast. My king of kings, the most powerful car I've got at all. It's got the best launch, best of everything. So, I'm jump out on this race. I'm going to end the recording out there. Got to try to sneak in a little bit of snapshot while we're racing. I'm going to adjust a few things, so we'll be back with you in just two seconds. Ooh, look at these Lamborghinis. Looks like it's an old Lamb Lamborghini race. Be definitely interesting. All right, might take highly skilled off. Come back down to a random of average. Bring simulation back on just so it brings up everything back up. All right, let's try this. Hopefully, don't fail this time. Seems legit. What the? Now, if this was real life, no Lambos would actually survive something like this. I've got traction control turned off, that's why. Maybe we should have picked the Forbies for this. We're this, this event we're definitely not getting past. I mean, that is just absolutely shit face, guys. We're gonna have to pick the four-wheel drives for that next time, and um, yeah, well. <laughs> well, I'm waiting for you to go, mate. So I'm getting definitely going to hella fast, so... Seven gears. Jesus. Well, that's definitely not what I saw happening. Alright guys, well that's going to this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. A bit of a short one, but you know, what can you do? So until the next one guys, I'm Boston Boston, go through to the game. Take care. Peace out. These